the community is growing, not just in Vancouver, but all the way across BC uh, to the point where you're able to be required in this kind of space, uh, which we're so happy you've been used to, to conduct worship and to meet and to do the community affairs that you're committed to. Uh, the celebration that you're about to embark on is, is an important one, and one that uh, leads, I think, from a period of reflection and, uh, and sacrifice and focus on your own spiritual values towards, as uh, we were hearing earlier, a period of celebration and a chance to go out into the world and, and take the lessons you've learned and apply them, uh, hopefully contributions to our wider community. And it, I, I just uh, was thinking about what I should say today in addition to that, and I feel that as an elected official, I have an obligation to go beyond the basic readings and talk about some of the global issues that are confronting us and how I hope that uh, elected leaders and faith communities in, in BC and Vancouver will tackle them. We always acknowledge in Vancouver that we're on the unceded territory of the West Way of the Squamish and Tsleil the First Nations. If you were here 200 years ago, they would only be uh, members of the First Nations and their villages here on this site. This is how, how young, I mean, you people are from all over the world. Uh, 200 years is a blink of an eye in, in some of the uh, countries that you're coming from. And yet that's how recent the settler society is here. And, and so we're really building a new community. Uh, thanks to the uh, hospitality that we've had from the First Nations. Not hospitality that was always asked for, sometimes just it's assumed or, or taken for granted. And, and, uh, and we have an opportunity to do something new and very better and much better and much more inclusive. But we have to be open to uh, having this dialogue continuously. We can't assume it will happen on its own. In that regard, I was very disappointed in the uh, comments made, uh, I think yesterday, by the Premier of Quebec who, uh, on commenting on a violent incident that occurred in uh, the United States, said that it was the obligation of a particular uh, religion, in this case, uh, the uh, Islam, to confront violence in our society. I disagree with him because no one has the right to step back from the job of fighting violence and building a, a peaceful society, an inclusive and tolerant society. That's everybody.